Hey guys, so today's video is going to be a get ready with me weekend edition. So this is what I do on the weekend when I don't want to spend too much time in the house and I just want to get out and enjoy the sunshine. This is also a collaboration with Lauren from Lauren Rose, who is also going to be doing a get ready with me. So make sure you pop over to her channel and check out her video. I will have it linked below because she is stunning. Anyway, on to my video. Okay, so first up, we have this orange tree down the back of our yard, and it's just come to that time where we can now pick the oranges and eat them. So today, I am picking a few, and I'm going to be making some orange juice, some fresh orange juice. We love drinking fresh juice that we make ourselves. We're also going to have some other fruit with the oranges. So we've got some strawberries, some lovely grapes, as well as some dried figs. So first up, I am cutting my oranges in half. And then I am using the squeezer thing <laughs> to squeeze the juice into a glass. This is some juice that we made yesterday, so I just added that to the juice that I was doing today. Then I'm just chopping up my strawberries and placing them in a bowl along with the grapes and the figs. Next I am pulling out my fry pan and I'm putting some bread in the toaster. Four pieces, two for Tim and two for me. Then I am putting the fry pan on the highest heat because I'm going to be frying up some eggs this morning. Just putting a little bit of butter into the pan. This was a bit of a fail anyway. <laughs> and then cracking my two eggs into the fry pan. And the toast is done. So I'll get them out and then butter them. And then I'm applying my favorite spread, which is Vegemite. All my international friends, this is how you eat Vegemite. Toast, thick layer of butter, thin layer of Vegemite. Mmm, this is perfect. Best thing ever. Of course, Tim is trying to steal my Vegemite toast, but I stopped him immediately. And then pop the eggs on top of the toast. And then we are good to go. All right, on to skincare. First, I am starting with my Garnier Micellar Water and I'm just applying that to a cotton round and then just going all over my face and my eyes. Then I am applying my Neutrogena sunscreen. I always, always wear sunscreen underneath my makeup, no matter what, because the sun is very harsh here in Australia. Then I'm going in with my Body Shop Neutrogenics eye cream and just patting that in underneath my eyes and then using my Olay complete oil-free moisturizer all over my face and that is it for skincare now moving on to makeup I am using a primer the Too Faced Primed and Poreless oil-free primer I always wear a primer no matter what. It just helps my makeup last so much longer. <laughs> then going in with my current favorite foundation, which is the Bourjois Healthy Mix um, Foundation in shade 51 because I'm super pale like that. <laughs> and I'm using my Real Techniques Expert Face Brush to apply it. Then going in with a little bit of my NARS eye primer. I always wear eye primer again because I have oily skin. Next, I'm applying my under eye concealer with the Soft Blend Concealer Brush from Sigma. This is from the Sigma Tech Essentials Kit. And because it has synthetic bristles, it makes it excellent for using creams and liquids because it doesn't soak them all up in the bristles. Loving, loving, loving this brush lately. Then going in with my Benefit Hello Flawless Powder and I'm just setting my under eye concealer and the rest of my face. Next is brows. <laughs> I can feel it being loose. I'm like, no, I won't fall off. 
And that's what happens when you need a new brush for your eyebrows. Anyway, so I'm using my MAC eyeshadow in Omega and I'm just doing my usual regular brow routine. So just filling them in a little bit. Then I'm going in with my bronzer, which is the Honey Bronzer from The Body Shop. And I'm just going underneath my cheekbones and around my forehead. Nothing too much. Nothing major. You can just see it. Then I've been loving Coralisa from Benefit. This was in my July favorites. Love, 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 love this blush. So I'm just applying that to my cheeks with my Sigma F10 blush brush. And then I'm taking that bronzer again. I'm just dusting that through my crease just for a little bit of definition, but not too much. Then I'm going in with my Smashbox Limitless Cream Shadow in Quartz, which is a silvery pink. And using my E32 from Sigma, the exact blend brush. This is from that same collection of Sigma Tech brushes. So it's really good with creams because of the synthetic bristles. And I'm applying that all over my lid and then blending it out with my E35. Then just taking a little bit of that same shadow on my Sigma E45 on my lower lash line. Next it's time for mascara and I'm using my Maybelline Lash Sensational Mascara. I've been loving this one. I did a two minute limit review on it, so I will link that below. Then popping on a little bit of gloss. This is the NYX Butter Gloss in Eclair. And that's it for this video. Thanks for watching guys. And don't forget to check out Lauren's video. I will have the link below. Thanks, bye.